Lipoproteins. Let's take a look at the introduction. Lipoproteins are a group of proteins synthesized in the small intestine and liver that transport hydrophobic lipids such as cholesterol, triglycerides, and phospholipids throughout the body. Types are named based on the density of their contents and include chylomicron, chylomicron remnant, very low density lipoprotein or VLDL, VLDL remnant or IDL which is intermediate density lipoprotein, LDL which is low density lipoprotein, and HDL which is high density lipoprotein. An important point to note here is that chylomicrons are the least dense and HDL are the most dense lipids present in lipoproteins, triglycerides, phospholipids, free cholesterol which is unesterified, cholesterol ester. Structure. The structure consists of a hydrophobic core and a hydrophilic shell of varying lipids. The core, which is hydrophobic lipids, are made up of cholesterol esters and triglycerides. The shell, which is hydrophilic lipid components, consists of free cholesterol, phospholipids, and hydrophilic proteins, so-called apolipoproteins. Basics of lipid transport. Lipids are nonpolar substances and the transport medium in our body is blood, which is polar. Lipids are insoluble in a polar medium, so they cannot be transported directly or alone. So for transportation of lipids in the body, they need a vehicle to overcome this problem. Hence, lipoproteins play a crucial role in transportation of lipids by making them polar with a lipid and protein combination. The lipid portion, which is nonpolar, is placed in the core and the protein portion, which is polar, is placed in the periphery so that lipoprotein can easily travel in the blood and helps in the transportation of lipids from one place to another. Chylomicrons A lipoprotein that carries lipids and cholesterol from the small intestine to adipocytes cardiac muscle and skeletal muscle. It is composed of an outer phospholipid with embedded apolipoproteins and a core containing lipids and cholesterol. Chylomicrons are very large particles. It is mainly composed of triglycerides more than cholesterol. Chylomicrons contain diet-derived triacylglycerol. Chylomicrons are secreted by the intestinal epithelial cells into lymphatic. Functions Transport of dietary triglycerides from the intestine to the peripheral tissues. Chylomicron remnants are chylomicrons that are depleted of triglycerides. Transport of cholesterol to the liver in the form of chylomicron remnants. Apolipoproteins associated with chylomicrons are ApoE, ApoC2, which activates capillary lipoprotein lipase, and ApoB48. Very low density lipoprotein, VLDL. VLDL is a lipoprotein secreted by the liver. It comprises of triglycerides more than cholesterol. Its function is that it transports triglycerides from the liver to the peripheral tissues. It is converted to LDL by hydrolysis of fatty acids by capillary lipoprotein lipase. Apolipoproteins associated with VLDL are ApoE, C2, and B100. Intermediary density lipoprotein or IDL. Its composition is cholesterol and triglycerides. Degradation of VLDL forms IDL. It transports triglycerides and cholesterol to the liver 
from the peripheral tissues. Apolipoproteins associated are ApoE and B100. Low-density lipoprotein, LDL. It is composed more of cholesterol than triglycerides. LDL is formed from IDL, secondary to hepatic lipase, with modification in peripheral tissue and the liver. It is endocytosed by target cells with LDL receptors and degraded, releasing cholesterol, which decreases further uptake of cholesterol. It transports cholesterol from the liver to peripheral tissues. It is commonly referred to as bad cholesterol. Apolipoproteins associated are ApoB100. High-density lipoprotein, HDL. It is mainly composed of cholesterol more than triglycerides. It is secreted by intestinal epithelium and liver. It transports cholesterol from peripheral tissues, example atherosclerotic arteries, to the liver by reverse cholesterol transport where it is excreted, example via bile. Hence, called as good cholesterol, the higher the concentration, the lower the risk for coronary artery disease. Apolipoproteins associated are ApoE, A1, and C2. ApoA1 component of HDL activates LCAT to form cholesterol esters, transfers ApoC2 and ApoE to nascent chylomicrons and VLDL. Apolipoproteins Proteins present in lipoproteins are known as apolipoproteins. Their synthesis occurs in the rough endoplasmic reticulum and Golgi. They are ApoA1, A2, B48, B100, C1, C2, C3, and E. Functions of apolipoproteins A1 it activates lecithin cholesterol acyl transferase, which is LCAT, that esterifies tissue cholesterol picked up by HDL. It is a major structural protein for HDL. Apolipoprotein C2. It activates capillary lipoprotein lipase, which releases fatty acids and glycerol from chylomicrons, VLDL, and IDL. Apolipoprotein B48 is a component of chylomicrons. B100 contains the B48 domain plus the LDL receptor recognition domain permitting binding to LDL receptors. It's the only structural protein in LDL. Apolipoprotein E mediates uptake of chylomicron remnants and intermediate density lipoproteins by the liver. Density of lipoproteins. Density is directly proportional to the percentage of proteins. Density is inversely proportional to Tg content and size. So chylomicron has the least density and largest size maximum Tg content, and minimum proteins. HDL has maximum density, so is smallest in size, has minimum Tg and maximum proteins. Based on electrophoretic separation, from cathode to anode, the order of lipoprotein in an electrophoretogram is as follows. Chylomicron, LDL, which are beta lipoprotein, VLDL, which are pre-beta lipoproteins, IDL, or broad beta lipoprotein, and HDL, alpha lipoprotein.